ऐसे गृहस्थ है हाउस होल्ड यू हैव योर ऑब्लिगेटरी ड्यूटीज इन सोसाइटी इवन वाइल वर्किंग इन द सोसाइटी constantly remember him that the world outside is nothing but he when you come home wash at least for a few moments exclusively try to turn your mind's attention and uh, devotion not to him short time 10 minutes every day at least 10 or 15 minutes Read at least one mantra of the Upanishad or two verses of the Gita to understand. You and I, we are not progressing spiritually because all that we do is only two minutes emotionally. We turn towards him, and that too half-heartedly. Even emotionally turning is not all emotion. It is only a kind of consistent and shameless beggary you are not praying to god but praying upon god praying upon god is animals do pray upon jump upon try to force him to do what you want therefore even though i am practicing nothing is happening and again you are only practicing emotionally your body and mind intellect are not brought into the same path you cannot move from one plane of consciousness to another unless all the three aspects of your personality is centered with it if you have got a back pain you can't sleep that day if you are emotionally upset you can't sleep that day If you have got intellectually a problem, you can't sleep that day. If you wanted to sleep from the waking to go into the sleep condition, all the three aspects of your personality must wish, must learn to surrender, in order to reach the next state of consciousness. Thus, in spirituality also, you can awake from your state of ego into the higher state of the self. only when all the three aspects of your personality is equally involved in this great grand surge now one would think that reading that verse that krishna is very much prejudiced he is a supporter of devotion only no in the following two verses the teacher points out that the path of contemplation also is equally great that path also takes you to the same goal experience divine that bhakti or devotion can take you